Hello everyone, welcome back to this tutorial on Informatica MDM Cloud. In this tutorial, we are going to understand very basic but equally important terms which are used in day to day activities while developing the MDM Cloud solution. So what are these terms? These terms include org or organization, secure agent, chiclets and pods. We are going to understand all these terms in detail in this tutorial. But before deep diving into it, make sure you like this video and subscribe my channel. So let's start with the very first term, org or organization. It is used in interchangeably. So what is this org or organization means to us? As a developer or architect or tester, we need to know this term. In Informatica IDMC, an org or organization, it is nothing but a logical grouping of various assets, users, resources, as well as data. It is used to manage the access to the data and the applications which we develop using the various components in the Informatica IDMC. We have to also make sure the data is secure and to achieve that security, we need to have the org or organization. Each organization has its own set of permissions which define who can access the data or which applications will be available to use. So in short, organization it is nothing but a, a broader bucket which includes multiple projects. So you can have the multiple MDM project within the same org. You can have the multiple components such as IDQ component or MDM component or even your job execution component. All those components will reside in that given org. You can have the org and the sub org, this kind of component. Suppose you have like North America region, you have South America region. You can develop all those components within one org and you can assign North America as a sub org and South America as a another sub org. So in short, you can create multiple sub org within the org. An org is a, a broader bucket which consists of all the components which will be used across the org components. So the next term is nothing but the secure agent. So what is this secure agent? The secure agent is a, a software component that runs on a physical or virtual machine. It can run in the either customer's environment or we can use the runtime environment which is provided by Informatica. So secure agent is nothing but it's a software which we need to execute at a customer's environment end so that we can connect to the Informatica MDM cloud components. So that software we can install on our physical machine or we can have the virtual machines where we can install it. So what is the purpose of this secure agent? Secure agent is responsible for connecting to the Informatica cloud. But not only that, we can execute the jobs by using this secure agent. So if you want to run the load process, which will push the data from your on-premise sources to the cloud, Informatica MDM cloud. So that load process has to go through the secure agent. The secure agent also provides the security features such as encryption and authorization. This will definitely going to help to protect the data or even if you're not only at the storage level, but when you're executing the real-time calls or real-time API integration, when the data is in transit, that time also it get protected. Okay, let's understand the next important term and that is nothing but chiclets. You can google it the chiclets, you will get the very basic uh, definition of chiclets. But in terms of Informatica IDMC, it has a special meaning. Chiclets are very small rectangular icons which will show when you are logging to the IDMC portal. So those rectangle icons represent the application or a task. Suppose you have the IDQ application, you have the Informatica MDM application or we call it a business 360 console. Then we have the 
data standardization component and so on so all those microservices are represented in the form of rectangular icons on the portal and those icons are called chiclets they are displayed in the idmc user interface that's what i call as a portal and it can be used to launch those application or the task or even to search the record or view the data you can use the administrator chiclet to manage the resources you can manage your organization sub organizations even the user groups and their additional components so in short the chiclets are nothing but this is the user interface component by using which you can execute the microservice okay let's understand the next term pod or idmc pod what is this pod or pod stands for pod stands for point of delivery all other terms such as org secure agent chiclets they are very commonly used very daily basis but the pod is very rarely used but it is more important with respect to your infrastructure so pod uh, it is nothing but it is a geographical region where informatica idmc is hosted so it can be hosted in east side of the north america west side of the north america so this is a geographical point where your idmc is hosted nowadays if you might hear some news so they are informatica is trying to generalize all these pods so because they have the multiple location they want to apply the similar rules and uh, execution mechanism across this bit different geographical location so coming back to the pod so each pod has its own set of infrastructure as we know it's a geographical location where the idmc is hosted so definitely will have its own infrastructure which include the servers the software and the networking equipment which allow the informatica to provide a high level of performance and ability uh, to perform the various tasks to its customer so what are the currently available regions uh, there are three basic regions available in america europe and asia specific suppose in america we have north america south america europe we have europe and united kingdom in asia we have the asia specific and japan when a customer creates an idmc account they are assigned a specific pod based on their ge geographical location or the preference the pod that is a customer is assigned uh, it depends on their locations and their data sovereignty requirement so what is their rules and regulations they need to follow for that the data which they own based on that also it matters the term pod is also used to refer specific instance of the idmc within that region for example na1 pod 01 right so this is nothing but it is a instance number 1 on of the idmc that is hosted on the north america region idmc pods are designed to be highly scalable and reliable of course they have their own infrastructure in that sense so they can be used to support a wide variety of data management workloads so if you have millions or if you have billions of record to process this can handle it so not only for your data lo load or data enrichment as well as the data quality data governance all those aspect of the data can be handled using those different pods now let's understand uh, some basic correlations between the org secure agent and chiclets how they work with each other how they work together so org secure agents and chiclets work together to provide a secure and the scalable environment for our data integration needs orgs are used to manage the access to the data and the applications each org has its own set of permissions which define who can access the data and the application on other hand the secure agents are used to connect to the informatica cloud and execute the job the secure agent also provides security features such as encryption and authentication etc on other hand the chiclets which is the small component 
or the small icons on the IDMC portal are used to manage or view the resources. So in short, they are interconnected with each other. If you do not use one of these or they, you cannot use those independently, they are connected. So if you want to use chiclets to perform data quality check, it has to go to the secure agent for a given org. So that's what means they are interlinked with each other. Let's understand um, why to use this and what are the benefits of the org secure agents and chiclets. There are many benefits for the org secure agents and chiclets and which are basically cat categorized in the three. One is to improve the security, second is increase the scalability and third is improve the usability. Org and security agent help to provide the data security as well as the environment security. So that covers this to improve your security in your network or especially you when dealing with the data. The scalability checklist can be used to launch a specific task or view the task which will help to improve the scalability of data integration workflows. And usability, uh, IDMC comes with a user interface such as a reference 360, customer 360 and so on. Those can be accessed through the chiclets. So in short, the org, secure agent and chiclets are essential components of Informatica IDMC. They work together to provide secure and scalable environment for your data integration. By using these components, organization can improve the security, scalability and usability of the data integration workflow. So these are the very important key terms and very commonly used. So I thought I should create the video for you guys. If you like this video, please do not forget to subscribe my channel and feel free to provide your comment if you are looking for any specific topics on Informatica MDM Cloud. Thank you for watching this video. Have a wonderful time.